Good afternoon. This is the National Weather Service in Anchorage, Alaska, with Monday's Alaska statewide weather. Strong low pressure area becoming stationary in the Gulf of Alaska, pushed rain and wind in across the southeast coast, with a front pushing into western Canada this afternoon. Rainfall amounts range from three quarters of an inch today at Juneau, Huna, Sitka, and Ketchikan. Montague Island, southern Prince William Sound, had one and a half inches of rain. It was drier along the southwest coast and windier, with winds gusting 30 to 40 miles per hour along the coastline and 30 to 40 mile an hour north northwest winds with showers were recorded across the Alaska Peninsula. It was mostly sunny along the west coast from the northern Yukon Delta to the Noatak Valley area and in toward uh, the Kobuk Valley. For tonight, look for some light snow along the Arctic coast, locally over the north slope to the Brooks Range. It'll stay wet for the North Gulf Coast, and for the southeast coast, there's another trough in south and southwest flow. Keeps moisture moving into the panhandle. Look for drier and uh, conditions and some clearing for Kodiak Island. It'll stay breezy over the Alaska Peninsula with some diminishing winds along the southwest coast and mostly dry conditions up into the Yukon Delta northward to the Western Brooks Range. For Tuesday, Chance of some light shower activity over the north slope and portions of the Arctic coast, but amounts will be very light. Showers are likely over south central Alaska, with periods of rain continuing from the Chugach Mountains into the southern Copper River Basin, especially along the north Gulf Coast. Showers and rain are in store for the southeast coast again for Tuesday with lighter winds, and winds will continue to gust to 35 miles an hour along the Alaska Peninsula. And the outlook for Wednesday, another storm system will push into the western Bering Sea with the front trailing southward across the west central Aleutians, bringing breezy conditions and rain into that area, but will stay west of Adak and Atka. Look for scattered, isolated shower activity for the north slope and along the Arctic coast, and scattered showers are likely over the central interior, and showers will continue along the north Gulf coast into the Panhandle, with another trough in that area and the slow con low continues to weaken over the western Gulf of Alaska.